Hello and welcome to my reaction to another idol song. And this is Yui no Crescendo by Yoko Tanaka or Sunset Crescendo. Uh, yeah, I think this is my first time checking it out. I just checked on my channel and I didn't find anything with her name. So hopefully I'm not wrong. I do check out so many artists all the time, so sorry if I forgot, Alan. But yes, thank you for all the requests as always. Uh, and yeah, all I can say is let's see what she's got. When did this come out? Uh, 1990. 1990. All right, I would have probably said 1980. Just looking at the cover and our look and everything, right? So, good thing that this was corrected. Uh, and I'm just noticing something, like a name that I actually know. Uh, Aranger Shiro Sagisu. I wonder if this is the same one that does like a ton of um, anime music. He's very legendary, he's done Bleach and... Frankly, he's worked on like a ton of massive anime, Bleach, uh, I think uh, Fairy Tail, I think many Gundam stuff. Um, Probably some more recent stuff like Boku no Hero, maybe. Like he does some of the most epic anime songs. So I don't know if this is the same guy. Might be, might be, might be. And uh, composer Megumi Ishii. Okay, well, let's see how good this is. Uh, link in the description for the original video. The link to the Yoko Tanaka Topic channel. The link to my Discord if you want to follow me. My stream element and Patreon. Best way to support me. Let's go. Yeah, sounds like classic idol music. Mm. Yeah. Oh, that's pretty badass. Let's go. Super clean voice. Super clean mixing. That's a very man song. Our voice is pretty cool. Uh, uh. I like the build up shit of the song. Yeah. Mm. Nice guitar. Cool. So I was gonna say, yeah, like really good voice. I mean, she has that you know useful idol kind of a uh, kind of tone of the eighties, nineties uh, song we checked out. But also she's got some power and just kind of like a cool tone a little bit as well. Um, less timid sounding than some of the other one we might have checked out before. So I do appreciate that. Huh? This song has a very cool kind of like build up to it. It feels like it's constantly building up and building energy. And it's very busy in terms of like, you know, music elements and, and sound and everything. Uh, sounds really clean, awesome mixing and all that. I like it, I like it, I like it. Um, yeah, it's pretty good. She sounds really... Oh, what's the big team in this section? No? Why the range of emotion in our voice? No? Uh, we like the transition to the chorus. No? So cool every time it comes in. Jumping really adds some energy as well. 
Oh. 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 Love that song. Oh. Oh. That's a great effect song. Nice. A good rock style there. A good rock style. Man, if only they had extended that, that last part of the song quite a bit more. That would have been nice. That would have been nice. Pretty good. Pretty good. Pretty good. I mean, what's there not to love? Really great voice. The main singer, again, she's got some range. Sometimes, you know, she's got that useful kind of innocence, but sometimes she actually sounds way cooler. And at one point, there was like a section that felt um, it's a bit seductive, maybe, is how I would put it. I don't know if that's quite the right way to describe it, but a little bit. A little bit, I felt like. Um, so really like the, the sound of that. Music-wise, it's very full. I mean, again, I don't know if this is the same as Shiro Sagisu, but his composition done to be super epic and, and super full. Uh, the OBC was listed as like Arranger on this one. So I can't really <laughs> exactly tell, right, if this is the same guy. But um, music-wise, yeah, it was really busy in all the, the right kind of way. There was a lot of cool sound and cool melodies going on at the same time. A lot of like stuff to focus on and, and to listen to. Love the drums, love the guitar. Um, you know, there was like a, like a ch -ch 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 kind of sound. I don't know exactly what it was, but, you know, it also had uh, some flair to everything. Just uh, catchy, catchy, catchy. I know I say catchy for like so many songs, but I mean it, I mean it. I was into it. Feels pretty good. Feels like a pretty good song. Okay, well, if this is actually my first time seeing Yoko Tanaka, yeah. Great, uh, great voice and another idol that I definitely wouldn't mind hearing more from. So I don't know. Thanks again for another introduction. And everybody, thank you for watching. As always, like, subscribe, comment. Ciao, Turoku. Yolush Konechimas, and I'll see you guys next time. See you. See you, see you.